watching K Gun 9 on your side. News at 6. Raytheon's operations in Tucson should stay busy as the U.S. sends more sophisticated weapons into battle instead of ground troops. That is the message Arizona Senator John McCain brought to Raytheon workers today as he spoke at the Raytheon Center in Rita Ranch. Not in your sides, Craig Smith. Talk to the senator. Guy, Raytheon is Tucson's largest private employer, so keeping Raytheon and its workers busy is important to the economy here. Senator John McCain told workers there he foresees plenty of demand for what Raytheon builds. Raytheon says the Tomahawk cruise missile has been used more than 2,000 times in combat in places like Iraq and Libya. Its ability to launch from ships and submarines, fly 1,000 miles and hit with precision, makes it a favorite for maximum impact with minimal risk. Senator John McCain helped reverse the U.S. Navy's decision to stop Tomahawk production here. He told Raytheon workers it made no sense to stop building tomahawks until a replacement is ready. The senator is calling for more air power to help the Kurds fight Islamic extremists in Iraq with only enough U.S. ground troops to make sure aircraft and missiles hit their targets. We would just have to have some, but not a massive injection of ground troops. But we do need, and we have got right now, boots on the ground, in the form of special forces and forward air controllers to identify these targets and to help with the, uh, with the Iraqis as they fight against ISIS. McCain talked about an important new product for Raytheon in Tucson. Raytheon is in an agreement to build and market the Israeli-designed Iron Dome anti-missile system that's helping to protect Israel from Hamas rockets right now. Guy.